Thanks, Austin. It was like a scene out of a movie, only it was a real-life drama unfolding in the West End. Yes, last night, as a young woman dangled from a highway overpass, three citizens, including a city councillor, rushed to her rescue. Now, CTV's Alicia Markson picks up this story. Alicia? Well, Tom, the heroes of this story chalk it up to being in the right place at the right time, but it's thanks to their quick thinking that a woman in her early 20s is alive tonight. I was leaning over, holding her like this, onto her hands. As traffic whizzed by on the QEW at Islington during last night's rush hour, overhead, a dramatic rescue was taking place. Today, the three heroes reunited to tell the story. Vashti King and Arwen Atkinson were driving by when they saw a woman in distress. I said, stop the car, and I flew up my door. I ran over just as this woman was holding on to this, dangling from this railing, just holding on. I grabbed right over grabbed her arms and I and she let go and I held her there and was screaming come and help come and help I need her my help and so Arwen pulled over from the road came running back and grabbed one arm and I had one arm and the two of us were screaming come and help it was a busy Friday night both here on the Islington Bridge and down below on the QEW as the woman tried to jump traffic ground to a halt and a number of motorists actually abandoned their cars and ran over to that hill to try and climb up here and help. But there was no time for that. Vashti and Arwen were losing their grip. Luckily, City Councillor Mark Grimes was a passenger in a car driving by at that precise moment. His friend Jim Surfless was driving. Mark actually jumped out of the car while it was still moving. By the time I got to a complete stop down there, he'd already ran back and the two girls were holding uh, the other girl going over the side. People were telling her, don't, don't do, do it, it, don't, don't do, do it. it. And this couple, Marlene and Jean-Luc, watched from their car as Councillor Grimes stepped in with seconds to spare. He ended up grabbing her by the belt and flipped her over and saved her. Uh, it was uh, like Superman. So I reached down and grabbed her by her belt and kind of the back of her shirt and her neck and that is, we flipped her right over. But, uh, you know, I had something really good to grab onto, thank God, and we pulled her over. But uh, she was she was slipping. It was kind of down, down. It was just like right out of a, a diehard movie. Arwen, what were you thinking when Mark arrived? Thank goodness there's someone strong here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we, we, we were totally thankful that, uh, that uh, he was there to help to pull her back over and hold on to her. Uh, these women are the real heroes. I mean, I was lucky to be there because if uh, it wasn't for those two, we would have lost her before I even got here. Grimes then held the agitated woman in a bear hug until emergency crews arrived on the scene. What a story. Councillor Grimes was handily re-elected in, this, in Ward 6 in this week's municipal election. I just got off the phone with him and he says he checked on the woman today. She is in hospital doing well and her family has been notified. As for the two women who helped save her life, he is going to recommend them for a civilian citation. I'm Alicia Markson. Janice? Thanks, Alicia. An incredible story.